Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you can open other Windows applications from Microsoft Excel. This is um, this is just a clipping that I made and so what I'm going to do is create a macro from VBA code to attach to this picture and then that'll allow me to open up Word and we can open up other applications as well and uh, we'll take a look at that so the first thing I want to do is go to view view macros we don't have any this button won't let me create I have to name something before I can create one so I'm gonna call it open WD for open word create and here I want to type in application activate Microsoft app I can choose that space and then notice all the options that we have uh, access Fox Pro mail PowerPoint project schedule plus word we, we actually have the option to open any of these up from uh, from Excel so all you'd have to do is let me choose one real quick really all we'd have to do is copy this paste it change this name and then change this section of the code and then we could have a macro to open up any of these applications so let me test this I'm gonna go back to Excel. I'm gonna assign the macro we just created to this button. Choosing this. Select OK. So this should open up Word once I click it. And I believe if you have Word already open, I don't think it'll open another instance. I think it already okay so yeah word is open now let's see what happens when you I don't think it'll open another instance of Word. yeah it just takes you to word when you click it so another thing we can do since we have this macro and remember that you can create these for other applications now that we have this macro you can actually add it add it up here to your tabs so to do that you can go to file options customize ribbon and let's just say oh yeah I want to open up the developer tab because there's another way that we can open open up where we can use the command button so let me just put I'll put it in the developer tab so let me find okay so macros this is the only macro that we have I'm gonna add this to the developer tab okay it's actually making me add make a new group So we'll call this group Windows Apps. I'll just give it an icon. Now I can add this. And you can rename them. I just want to give it a blue, a blue icon, and we'll call it. I'm just going to call it Word. So, yeah, if you want to open Word from here, yeah. Oh, let me close this Word that we already have open, and we'll make sure it works. Yeah, so you can add uh, links to open applications to your tabs up there. 
And another thing we could do is if you'd rather have a command button than a picture, you can go to the developer tab, insert, and trace out a button. And then it wants you to attach a macro. We'll select this one and OK. And then we can rename it. But to get to activate it, we have to click off of it and give it a click. There we go. So that's how you open up Word from Excel. And then, yeah, a couple different options for you uh, to be able to open that up. And one more thing. I want to go back. So to easily, you can easily replicate this to make other links to applications by copying. And then, so we'll call this open PowerPoint. And then the only thing we have to change is this last part. Here we go. Open PowerPoint. And that's it. So you could create a button for all those up applications that you saw on the list there. I uh, hope this video was helpful for you. Have a good day.